गाइज वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल लिटिल बी विच सो एज यू नो आई एम ऑल ग्लैमड अप टूडे फॉर अल्टीमेट न्यू ईयर ईव मेकअप लुक एंड यू नो वॉट गाइज अ लॉट हैज हैपन विथ मी विथ यू विथ एवरी वन एल्स अराउंड दिस यूर एंड यू एग्जैक्टली नो वर आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट राइट लेट्स जस्ट यू नो कट दिस ऑफ लेट्स जस्ट नॉट टॉक अबाउट ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी एट ऑल एंड लेट्स जस्ट गेट रेडी फॉर न्यू ईयर ग्लैम पारी मेकअप लुक एंड गाइज डोंट फर्गेट टू हिट द बेल आइकन बिलो एंड डोंट फर्गेट टू गिव अ बिग थम्स अप एंड डोंट फर्गेट टू subscribe to my channel um yeah and let's begin also guys this is you know very simple and very you know um a beginner's guide so um i wanted something you know very subtle and sober and i don't want to go extra some smoky or anything because i want to be sober uh so yeah this is it and let's begin So guys this is my bare skin and my skin is you know really just breaking up during winter season I don't know what is the issue I just visited my dermatologist and um you know me that I'll be fine it because of you know the uh, seasonal change and hormonal change and all of that so um yeah I mean it's getting better so this you know just um has been settled down uh, it was really you know pussy acne and i'm using this neutrogena hydro boost so this is really great product for um, oily skin because this will you know just sulk into your skin so nicely guys now that is done and uh, you know while putting on a makeup my skin actually becomes little dry so uh, i'm going to use this cerafil daily advance ultra hydrating lotion you know guys even if your skin is oily after putting on makeup your skin starts breaking up uh, because you know not there's not enough uh, hydration and moisture so because of that reason i'm using this cerafil ultra advance hydrating lotion this acne is really really hurting me it's giving me a tingling effect uh, but i think i'll be i'll be okay and um, yeah so the reason i don't want to use oil is uh, because i think that you know this might um, oils can clog the pores and you know i might have more acne issues so i really want to avoid it uh, as of now because i'm already breaking out so um, yeah now we'll start with the foundation this is my skin prep i literally you know massage it for about a minute or two and yes really uh, keeping this face makeup really short uh, i am going to use this master prime uh, primer and you know just using a little here and there wherever it's necessary i'm majorly focusing on eye makeup today because i think now you know this base makeup is something we all know how to do it just putting up wherever it's necessary today i really can't go without my green color corrector uh now you can see the amount of redness like it has literally reduced and it's just a dark spot now so that that's what it does it just cancels out the redness today the green concealer is just all over my face uh guys there's nothing wrong applying makeup but what's wrong is you know not just taking enough care of your skin after uh using makeup and that's where you go wrong you know i'm going to use this maybelline matte poreless fit me foundation normal to oily skin and um i'm in the shade warm nude 128 and the best part is it has got pump and um so the reason why i'm using this foundation is a because i want something really very lightweight and the reason b is it's the only foundation i have right now so i'm just going to work it out this this really this really pains you know i'm just going to you know give another coat to this side you 
using this lightweight concealer from um, Maybelline. So for some of you the concealer turns out to be grey under eye and that is because that uh, you didn't correct your eyes so this you know will just cancel out the darkness and for brightening up now I'm gonna use this NYX jar uh, light pale is a dark circle concealer yeah that's what it does this is you know gonna brighten up and this jar is really really nice guys usually I don't you know go with so many layers uh, beneath my eyes it's just because my skin isn't really acting right so I'm using these products and uh, now I'm gonna use loose powder just to you know cover the under, under eye bags So as you can see the under eye bags are literally gone right That that really worked right The scar literally just is not visible now. So uh, I am gonna start with my eyebrows first because that gives a little more definition to my face and yeah. So I'm using this color bar um, chestnut 001 and just gonna do my brows. So guys how has 2020 treated you so far? I know uh, we all have been through some or the other thing uh, this year and it was very very tough for all of us um, for me it was also very difficult um, and more than that I'm grateful that I'm I've survived and I'm grateful that you know and my family are safe um, it's been really a very tough year for all of us I know that and you know we should be blessed that we are surviving today more than anything i just feel that a survival is more important in this year than any other thing now when i look back to 2020 um i feel the year has really passed so so quickly uh, but you know it has also taught me a lot a lot of things like in general also you know about self-love i know everyone just talks about self-love but you know um it's just very usual to talk about self-love but to actually practice it you know what it means you know uh, i'm sorry i'm again sounding very nasal today <laughs> So now I'm using this concealer jar again, clearing up my eyebrows. That makes a hell lot of difference. Oh yes, and talking about um, my makeup skills, actually it has got a lot, lot, lot better than what I used to do. So yeah, I'm learning. I'm making you learn. <laughs> And a lot of things are just happening with me like in general a lot of good things you know so now it looks really very lively so i'm gonna do cr cut crease today i don't know what's wrong i am using this palette for the first time it is desert dusk from huda beauty and i absolutely love the shades over here so i'm gonna use this it's gonna be a very simple subtle look so I'm gonna start with the shade Eden, which is Eden, which is uh, which is right here. It has you know a little bit of cream and uh, peach undertone if I'm not wrong. So yeah, this is Eden, and I'm gonna use that as my base shade. This 
gives a very light tint to your um, your eyelids and that's what I really like it's, a, it's a, you know really a good um, base talking about um, like personal goal this here was really uh, really fun for me it was you know really like a roller coaster ride uh, some days I literally felt like um, you know just breaking down and um, some days I was really happy and I felt like a lot of good things are happening to me and it has you know it has happened and um, I'm grateful in so so many ways this year for me was personally all about you know self-centric I learned a lot of things about self-care self-love I know you know that's very very common but I actually didn't feel like this before maybe because um, I was not practicing self-love I wasn't practicing self-care and that's what it more matters you know so I am uh, using this shade not only to the eyelids but also you know covering above my eyelids now I'm gonna be using this oud shade um, and my eyes has become really watery <laughs> anyway so this is oud and I'm just gonna use that uh, with a you know smaller blending brush this will be more um, concentrated one and you know won't spread out to your entire lid the fallout of the product is really a lot but that's okay for me I'm just putting it inside the socket of my uh, eye and the outer corner of my eye. I started my channel exactly, you know, one and a half year back and my makeup skills were trash. Honestly, it was very trash and now, you know, I can literally see the difference in me that I am growing, you know, in what I'm doing and um, personally as well. So that feels really great. If you see my previous videos, guys, you are literally gonna laugh at me. I myself don't even open those videos, you know, I feel like deleting it. That is just shit. Utter, utter shit, you know. But I kept going, I kept going and here I am. Not the best yet, but trying to be, you know, best at it. At least I'm trying, you know what I mean? I'm gonna take a bigger uh, blending brush now and just soften the edges. Just soften the above edges and not the socket because I want that, you know, crease line to be there. I really wanted to learn uh, salsa this year. I wasn't able to because uh, I think my body isn't flexible. So I started. Uh, so I started with um, uh, you know you need a very flexible body to do salsa and uh, mine isn't that flexible. So I started you know uh, with uh, Zumba and Arabic. So that is just gonna help me loosen my moves and. Um, yeah, I mean, it's been a long time since I'm doing Zumba and Arabics. I haven't started with salsa yet. It was really difficult, you know, for me to start it with uh, salsa because you need really smooth moves and all of that. And I don't have smooth moves. I mean, I can dance, but, you know, not like a smoother moves. You can see the difference, right? Uh, this is so soft and this is a little hard. So we are going to do the same here as well. And uh, another thing, the topmost list in my priority to-do list for 2020 was to get a driving license. Yes, I still don't have. And um, you know, because of this pandemic, um, my parents are still not allowing me to learn at driving school. Otherwise, I would have learned by now. Um, but I think that, you know, maybe within two months or something not two months uh, maybe like within three or four months I should have my driving license by now yeah 
now I, that's the goal I still didn't achieve in 2020 I'm again using that wood shade in the inner corner of my eye Now I'm gonna take this shade right here which is the uh, amber and it is the another brown shade. I know it's like I am 24, I don't have driving license. I know some of you, I still do get comments like oh you don't have driving license. I think that's okay for me. Uh, but now I really want to have one and I'll get it by um, by like you know march or april i believe because i'm gonna start learning now things have become pretty normal here i am making uh, that almond shape i need this to be sharp so yeah and i really like this palette you know it is worth five thousand bucks honestly again i'm gonna soften the edges So now I'm again gonna take this concealer jar and uh, put it just in the, inside the inner corner of my eyes and I'm gonna make it, you know, like a cut crease. Hmm. So just gonna take an angled brush or flat brush, whatever you are comfortable with. Guys, how was your 2020? Did you set any goals for yourself? this year so it was very important for me to get out of 2020 i'm gonna let this eye dry for some time and going to do the same here as well all my flat brushes are really in use so now i'm gonna take my finger and use this desert and um, you know use this desert sand which is so much like a nude shade this is you know just gonna set my eye just softening the edges here Again, I'm going to take the shade Amber and put it inside the outer corner. Now I'm going to take this shade which is like, which is Musk and just, and just you know put it here. This gives a little depth to your eyes. Um, okay, so now I'm gonna take this uh, flat brush and use this oud and amber shade together which we used previously and I'm gonna put it inside the inner corner of my eye. I don't know why is it so difficult to put it in the in, for the another eye. But I think uh, it's done, right? So um, yeah, I'm gonna put my lashes and I'll be back. I'm gonna take this mascara from Too Faced and put it under my waterline. I really have thin lashes, you know. So guys I used this Swiss Beauty and I did put this inside the inner corner of my eye and now I'm gonna contour my face with this uh, brush which is also you know blush brush but I don't have two separate brushes what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the tip of the brush and you know dig it inside a bronzer
I'm gonna take this blush from L'Oreal and it is uh, you know a coral shade the name is play with me yes play with me it's just the shade name guys don't take it personally this is literally bothering me I'm again you know try I'm again gonna try to cover it with I think it's better now okay I think I need more blush I think I'm gonna avoid highlighter today because my skin is uh, you know just breaking out so uh, it might just enhance my pores more so I'm just gonna avoid that and I'll be back So guys thank you so much for watching this video and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel in case if you haven't already and i see you guys in 2020 also guys i wish you a very happy and a prosperous new year and uh, i pray for your health and success and happiness for you and your family and happy new year